DBFE, alright? DBFE. Breathe it in. 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 Huh. I hear you. Everybody's in. Breathe it in. Welcome to the government, where we are always watching Oscar everything for two years. Then we put it all put in a document and print it out for the president. Check Can you believe the president still wants printed documents? We usually use it for good, but we also use it to play... Gespionage! <laughs> Looks like you have an audience. Let's start surveillance on them right now. We'll be asking questions specifically about them if we collect enough data. Otherwise, we'll use what we already have. Now let's administer some fun. All right, data first? time. Foolish humans. Yes, that one between the index and ring fingers. What percentage of drivers have flipped off fellow motorists within the last week? Give it your best guess. You get more points the closer you come to the actual percentage. Oh, and don't forget to answer the question too, audience. Every answer counts. I mean, if you don't, if you haven't, if you haven't You're almost been driving at all, if you don't have a license or whatever. Okay, we have you, a guess. Can you abstain 15%. from answering the question? Everyone else, now it's your turn. Do you think the correct answer is higher or lower? Yes. If okay. you think the guess is off by 15% or more, you can get double points by picking much higher or much lower. Uh, 15%. Uh, are you dumb? Alright. I was gonna be fucking higher because... Everyone says higher except for one of you. How did the audience answer? Chad is lying. Yeah. 20%! I've the got only big points for that guess. Only off driving is in fucking GTA Online. Who picks higher? Well done. You get points. As for you, ah, that's too bad. That answer was closer than 15%. Shouldn't have doubled down. Should not have doubled down. Okay, who's up now? Doubling down on chat being All alpha. Right. Oh, this is gonna be good. What percentage of people have worn bathing suits under their clothes because they were out of underwear? I did that not too long ago, like two weeks ago. You're yeah, almost out of time. Sixty-five percent. Everyone else, higher or lower? Uh, sixty-five percent more higher. <laughs> Most well, people said lower. Higher. Let's see the audience answer. 28%! Your guess wasn't within 30% of what? the correct answer, so you don't get any points. Never wore swimming trunks you right. under your well, jeans you get points. when you were out of underwear. And what have we here? Great answer. Double what? points for saying You're much lower. You're full of shit, dude. What the fuck? Who's next? Ooh. Let's see, what would be good? How about this? You fucking zoomers with your brands. What percentage of people said they would keep working at their jobs if they won $900 million in a lottery? What percentage of people said they would keep working at their jobs if they won $900 Ten percent. All right. What do you think? Uh, uh, chat. Oh, All right. <laughs> Not much higher. Ah. Like People are thinking it's lower. And what did the audience say? Eighteen <laughs> percent. Nice. That'll help your score. All right. I needed some uh, comeback money here. Let's see who got it right. Points for you! Next up! Alright, give me a. Oh, here's one, one we've been especially interested in. Don't ask why. Blessings. 
what percentage of post-sneeze blessers usually say bless you, not gesundheit, or something else after somebody sneezes? Uh, what percentage of post-sneeze blessers usually say bless you? Alright. Uh, I think... Bless you. Anytime now. I want to say... 68%. What? Everyone pick higher or lower. Ha! All right. Mm -hmm. oh, People are saying lower. And what does your audience think? 44%. Does the question mean? You get it points, means but how barely. many people say bless you after someone sneezing? Instead it right. of saying Gesundheit, points. which is bless you in German, or some other okay, variant in some other language, right? But apparently people Ooh, did not I understand the fucking question, so they didn't fucking answer it appropriately. What percentage of people have successfully retrieved prizes from one of those claw machines? They got it backwards. And they did 44%. 100% minus 44%. Higher or lower? It's 56%. I did 68%. I would have been in if you understood the fucking question. Alright. Huh? To safely retreat prices from one of those machines. Much higher. What the fuck are you talking about? Ooh, everyone thinks it's higher. Let's see the Much audience higher. answer. Be drunk. 51%! You weren't within 30%, so no points for you. Let's see who got it right. Nice job! I've I wish I would have gone the easy to understand question for the easy brain chat. Who's next? Ha! Okay, computer, what do you have for this one? Sneakers. What percentage of men have bought basketball sneakers because they were endorsed by an NBA player? Buys basketball sneakers, period. Zero percent. Okay, higher or lower? <laughs> uh, All right. Oh, I'm much higher, really. It's unanimous again. How did the audience answer? We have a lot of Americans. No! Yeah, not too shabby. What the fuck? Who got it right? Here's some points. Okay, where's who's any up next? when I need them? All right, I have a good one. What percentage of people ride bikes to work at least one day per week? Thirty-four percent. I mean, if you ever bought you a think? Jordan, higher or lower? Right. I went more, more American. All right. All right. Uh, fucking ah. lower. Drive fucking scooters Ooh. nowadays. Hurry up. And what did the audience say? Nineteen percent. That's what we call in the ballpark. Lucky. Let's see who got it right. Smart, yes. Here's your points. Next up. <laughs> We've collected data about everything, even this. Examination boners. What percentage of men have become noticeably sexually aroused during medical examinations? percent everyone else higher or lower bro what the fuck ha! get out of here dude. All right. are you gonna lie chat are you gonna fucking lie 
much higher, bro. Fuck off. Much lower. People are saying lower. Let's see the audience. I answer. believe in you, chat. These are full of shit. 36%! Wow, you were pretty close. Oh my god. Who got it right? No nice way. job, I've got some points no for you. No way, more than a third of people get a fucking boner. A medical examination. I'm fucking shit on uh -oh, your face. Oh, final round time. Everyone in the audience has been scanned so we could know how they would answer this question. What's the first city that comes to mind when people think of Europe? Let's see what people think. When people think Europe? You get three guesses. Try to pick the most popular answers to get the most points. All right, if I'm Ready, American and I go. hear Europe. If you're in the audience, pick the one you agree I with think most. Of you can totally determine the answer. This one. And I think of... Wait, what's the first city? Why is England in there? Why is France there? Wait, what Don't the forget to use this? all three of your picks. I'm, I'm picking France, dude. What the <laughs> fuck is this question? Okay, let's see what you picked. I'm picking Paris, France, and London. I think. Yeah. Okay, computer, show us the most popular answers. Fuck. Why is it on there then? Oh my god! Let's see who's the head honcho. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Not last. Wow, you have some serious knowledge of people's private personal lives. Well done. Chat, why do you lie so much? Huh? Can we do one without chat lying? <laughs> Alright, blocking it out. Attention all agents, the winner of the four days, four nights, all-inclusive vacation to the Area 51 Golf Resort and Spa is Agent Aletto. Please report to the front desk to let all us right, know your preferred I'm posting it in as the well as your head size so we can get a dark sack that properly restricts all the um, Congratulations. The first one was fake. Believe it. Breathe it in. So that you special it in. Alright. Oh, Alright. You Sure, it's your tax dollars. Weird Let's start system. another game of Gespionage. Let's start with you. Here's a little pick-me-up. What percentage of people can confidently explain the difference between a macchiato and a latte? Uh, can I even? Uh, it's the amount of milk. Okay, we have a no. guess. 40%. Everyone else, do you think the correct it's answer is higher or lower? You can also it? double down and guess much higher or much lower if you think the guess is off by 15% or more. 40% can explain the difference? No. Bro, we have an exclusive majority of men here. Lower. 100%. The vote is lower. Oh, they the think they answer? know. Maybe they think they know. 17%? No, Not terrible. You People get a few might points think at least. Yeah, men don't drink this Let's shit. Let's see who no. got it they right. They drink maybe a lot. Nice job. Know. I've got some uh, points for you. If they are you know, on the fence. But Macchiato, that's like, that's a good Alright. Typey, typey. Shit. 
showering. What percentage of people rinse shampoo out of their hair while facing the shower spray, instead of having their back to it or being directly under it? What percentage of people rinse shampoo facing the shower, sh shower? That should be like 80%. Wait, what? I see it's shed. Wait, what? Are you retarded? Wait. You don't want to get it in your fucking eyes. Okay. So you do it away from you. What the fuck? I hear you. 63. I say. Believe it. I say. Higher. One of you thinks it's higher. And what does your audience think? 26%! Wow. Terrible guess. You need to be within 30% to get points. You don't face Who got the right? shower head? Here's some points. Wait, what? Okay, who's up next? <laughs> Alright, Surveillance Pro, what do you have for this? What the fuck? What percentage of men prefer electric razors as their go-to face shaving device? What percentage of men prefer electric razors as their go-to face shaving device? I've never seen a face shaving device. <laughs> uh, I mean, most people You're almost out of shave, time. so I'm gonna go fucking... 55%. Alright, oh, what do you shit, think? Oh shit, other way around. I meant to go all right. I hear you. Full shorts. Please leave it. The majority say lower. And what did the audience say? 45%. I said 45%. You were pretty close. Nice. Ah. Uh. Let's see who got it right. Ooh, points for you. I meant 45%. I, I misread next? the order of the question. Which one was first? Mmm, this should be refreshing. What percentage of adults have drunk a Capri Sun in the past year? A Capri Sun? Is that shitty NA juice? I think it's uh, the, the, those with the fucking those little boxes, right? 16%. What do y'all think? Higher or lower? Uh, I yeah, I All mean... Right. I'm pretty sure lower. <laughs> Who the fuck drinks that shit, dude? No juice is in the chat. Running out of time. <laughs> Just one of you is saying higher. Let's see the audience answer. 25%! Nice, that'll help your score. Mod scroll up. Who got it right? Here's some points. Next up. Secrets. Have I ever told you all my brother was killed by falling prices? What percentage of people have visited a Walmart between midnight and 4 a.m.? I think Everyone I pick higher or lower. Actually, or it was one of those All right. fucking chains. I Maybe it wasn't Walmart. There was definitely a fast club. Uh, fucking higher. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Ooh, but not Everyone much says higher. higher. How did the audience answer? Twenty-two percent. Alright, we got some Americans wow, up in this close. bitch. We got some Americans up on Let's this bitch. who got it right. Well done. You get points. Okay, who's up next? What should I search for in the old Surveillance Pro next? Ooh, I know. 
Particulate, particulate. What percentage of people believe they can accurately explain what an atom is? Uh, accurately. The question is how in depth. You can say it's the building stones. Time now. 13%. Everyone else, higher or lower? All right. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's a much higher. <laughs> Just one person says lower. And what does your audience think? 69%. <laughs> You weren't within 30%, so no points for you. Who got it right? Smart, yes. Here's your points. Who's next? I hear you. Did you know if you say beer can, it sounds like you're saying bacon in a Jamaican accent? Beer can. What percentage of beer drinkers prefer macro brews to microbrewery beer? What percentage of beer drinkers prefer macro brews to micro brewery beer? What percentage of beer drinkers prefer macro brews to micro brewery beer? I don't know what the fuck this means. Twenty-one fuck macro brews. What do y'all think? Oh, All macro brews are like big breweries to like small small breweries. I guess I don't know Ooh, which sure. brands. Most of the brands are probably micro brews. But uh, I know what the micro brew is. So, uh, Running out lower. of time. Mm -hmm. One lonely vote for lower. And what did the IPAs, audience say? IPAs, like Sleeping Bulldog. 59%. You weren't within 30%, so no points for you. Let's you don't see even know what there right. is, chat. What well the fuck? done. You get points. Okay, who's up next? This master. Uh, I don't know. How about Heineken? You drink that shit? What percentage of people like fortune Morgan. cookies more for the cookie than for the fortune? It's garbage. Yeah, my point being, that's a typical example of a fucking macro brewery that 69% of the people like. Time's a-wasting. What? 70%. Everyone else, higher or lower? Alright. Oh, fortune of people like fortune cookies more for the cookie than the fortune. No, what? No way. Mm -hmm. Way lower. One of you is saying higher. Let's see the audience answer. Fuck. 52%! Stupid. That was a respectable guess. You got it right. Well done. You get points. It's time for the final round. We stalked everyone in the audience to learn how they would answer this question. What sport do people find the most boring? Let's see what we have. Soccer. But only the top three answers will get you points. Good luck! If you're in the audience, how you answer the question will affect who gets points. Remember, you can pick three answers, not just one. Alright. Yolo. Let's see what answers you chose. Now let's take a look at the results. That special someone. Mm -hmm. At last. <laughs> Congratulations.
Congratulations. Six plays, boys. Six plays. Not bad. Remind me never to cross you. We're pretty good. All right, boys. We're pretty good. For today, ladies and gentlemen, uh, Sfax, Coco9, KBXD, and Alfie Soul. Thank you, boys. Welcome, welcome back. Tomorrow is another day in the arena, ladies, and therefore I need some beauty sleep, alright? Thank you guys for watching, though. Thank you guys for the subs. Very subs. Don't know. Gifted subs and of course the bit the coin is uh, I will see you guys tomorrow. Stay beautiful, stay awesome, stay legendary. And I will catch you on the next episode, alright? Alright. Bye bye. Bye bye.